Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 39, and this is war number nine. We're getting closer to the end of the season. And we're going up against an alliance that I cannot pronounce their name, but let's see who they've got banned. Oh no, they banned my gallon. I hate them. I hate them already. Oh, I hate them now. No, 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 no. I hate them. Bump y'all. All right. Anyway. Hate the banning system anyway. Let's see who they got planned, I guess. Okay, so they don't have nobody there. And then they've got <sighs> Nimrod. So fortunately, I have options other than uh, Gallon. So that one, I'll probably bring in uh, Namor for that. All right. Um, look, we got Hit Monkey. I could take Hit Monkey. Um, Titania could probably do that node. All right. At least they didn't ban Claire. So Claire for, I guess, these two. And a Korg. Hmm. Um, I'll have to see who they want, uh, if he's going to bring in somebody for that Korg. But if I'm bringing in Namor, it is possible to take this fight with Namor. I don't think I've ever tried it though. So since I'm bringing in Namor, we can talk about that. Um, I'll bring in Claire and I'll also bring in uh, probably Titania. I'm thinking here. Yeah, maybe maybe uh Titania. So that might be my team. They banned my gallon, which I can't blame them. We're pretty much locked into uh platinum three, so not too big of a deal. Um yeah. I noticed they they may not they may just have been trying to be annoying. Yeah, I see. All right, well. Yeah, that's. I think that's what we'll do. So, Namor, Claire, and uh, Titania. Although I was thinking of bringing in Nimrod also, but no. Claire could also possibly do this uh korg as well so that's also an option so we actually have two options for for that one hmm all right let's get on with the fighting all right we're going in with a different team since they banned gallon i don't tell you uh but anyway fortunately we have options and before I started using Gallon, I was using Namor. Namor is a great option for this path as well. Not as good as Gallon, but he works, okay? Um, my Namor is Sig 200, so I will take zero damage while I'm attacking, and I will reflect all the damage that I would have taken back. So even though Nimrod can't be bled, for example, and even though Namor uh, will still get power burned and won't have any power, look at the damage that he's doing. All of that damage that you see on Nimrod right now is the damage that Namor would have taken. Okay, just look at this. In Battlegrounds, I also have fun with Namor. Uh, right now, the meta is a, you know, if they have an armor up, they power burn. And 
uh, folks, I'm sure, have their mouths drop open when I finish a fight against Colossus with 100% of my health. And keep in mind, I'm running the recoil masteries as well. But it doesn't matter with Namor. Just look at that. Okay, this one was unblockable. But I evaded it. What you know? It happens. And down he goes. So even though they banned Gallon, I had an option. And even if they were to ban Gallon and Namor, I still have another option for that path. Um, I believe Hulkling uh, can also do that path. Now, I'm not touching this man thing. This particular war was the first time we have a new, um, a new guy who took path one for the first time uh, this season. He just joined and he switched out with uh, Mad Mardigan. Mad Mardigan took the path that he was originally assigned to because he didn't have any experience on that other path, but he had a lot of experience on path one. And he had said that he can take out man thing easily. And so far he has done what he said he could do. So kudos uh, to him. All right. So, um, what you saw happen right there, uh, I don't know if you noticed it. Go back and, and you'll see it. It froze on me. It it didn't update, and I wasn't where I should have been because I had already clicked the um, node. It happens sometimes. And I clicked the node, and I noticed, and I said, you know what? I'm not going to go into any kind of fight or try to do anything with it acting like that. So I restarted. And see, now I'm down there. Before it kept stuck, you know, I was up there and I kept moving around trying to get it to do something. All right. So anyway, uh, we're on section two and we fight Emma. And the only thing that I check for Emma is whether she's awakened or not. I actually prefer Emma to be awakened because I'm already uh, trained. I've trained my fingers to reverse the controls when she fires her special or I could just block them. Um, she would be very, very nasty on defense if she had unblockable specials. Um, but in any case, I've already trained myself, as you see there. No problem. And as long as I hold my focus, we won't have any issues. Look at that. Just tearing her up. And I remember when she first came to the contest, I hated the uh, reverse controls. Still do. Really hate them. Um, I've gotten used to it with her, but they've implemented it in different ways. Like, um, oh, who was it? I think they, they had a, a node where magic had an unblockable special one and inverted controls on her special attack. That was ugly. Because her special one is quick. So that fight, oh man, I hated that fight. But we got through that fight. All right, now Sauron. Sauron is annoying. But I have been fighting against him for a little bit. So I'm fairly confident that I can take him down, maybe getting hit once. But I'm confident in uh, fighting this guy. All right, so he's getting all these prowesses. He's got a regen. Very, very annoying. But I want to take him down. Now, here's his unblockable. Okay. And it's gone. Here we are. Boom. Blocked it. It wasn't unblockable, so I blocked it. And I'm like, yes, good. I didn't have to deal with his unblockable. I'm in uh, Curse of Hellfire. And uh, look at this. Oh, wait. He's unblockable this time. Can't block it. But I evaded. Full evade. That's what I'm talking about. How y'all like me now? Uh, but anyway, uh, that was the last fight that I had to do. Uh, like I said, the new guy, uh, I think he claimed two of them. Because I could have taken, that's why I brought Titania. But he was able to take everybody down. All right, we'll be back and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're
we're back. And unfortunately, we lost this war as well. Uh, if you're counting, that's four losses in a row. Four losses. And we've had all kinds of issues. We had a jumper, you know. Um, so it's just been really unfortunate. Uh, you can see here, you look at our diversity. Okay. So you know something happened. All right. Um, in one of the, uh, let me see, in one of the fights, in one of the wars, we had somebody jump in the, uh, you know, middle. So we couldn't even place everybody. In another one, we had a guy, uh, his, his phone broke and he was waiting for the repair guy. He thought the repair guy would be able to, um, repair it in time. He wasn't able to, he wasn't able to participate in that war. All right. <clears throat> he, he, uh, didn't place defense and he couldn't, uh, fight on attack either. So we've had a, a series of things happen that kind of helped us lose. And then some of them, we just didn't fight well. Uh, but anyway, that's going to do it. Hopefully we will start winning. I believe we're locked into platinum three at this point. Um, but we still don't want to just keep on uh, losing. Uh, but anyway, take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed this video. And you all have a blessed day.